Operation Wallace here has been at work in Honduras for some years and has established both research and social programs. These are bringing benefit to Honduran people as well as providing amazing experiences and projects for students and volunteers engaged in the work. Much of Honduras is covered in dense rainforest with a staggering degree of biodiversity. This priceless natural resource needs to be monitored and managed if it's to survive. To that end, scientists are engaged in trying to understand the ecology of the rainforests. Only then can meaningful steps be taken to develop management programs and monitoring. For example, there are many bat species found in the rainforests including vampire bats. The size and morphology of bats found in an area give clues as to the density and quality of the rainforests. Bats can therefore be an important indicator species. The Kasuko National Park is an important water source for parts of Honduras. Opal scientists are developing indices of freshwater invertebrates that will be indicator species of water quality. It's an aim to use these to give early warnings of changes to water quality so that remedial action can then be taken. The social side to Operation Wallace Year's work in Honduras engages local people in conservation management. This is providing employment opportunities and negates the desire to exploit the rainforests in unsuitable and detrimental ways. These are just a few examples of studies being undertaken in Honduras. There are many more areas of study that scientists, volunteers and school groups are performing. A few examples include herpetology. or studies of factors influencing bird communities. That's perfect, thank you. For mammals. Moths. Beetle ecology. This is Corsina pastori. Um, it's the first one I found in the park. It's the second rarest of the seven species that have been recorded. There's a great deal of valuable work to be done, and Operation Wallacea invites you to share in what's going on by joining one of our scientific expeditions to Honduras.